welcome to Mahoney Dive's Quick Reviews. Okay, so today we're looking at the Macromate kit for Backscatter's Flip 7. Before watching this video, you might want to check out my review of the Flip 7 III filter kit, which I'll link below, since this review focuses entirely on the Macromate lens. The Plus 15 Macromate kit comes with a Plus 15 Macromate lens, a 55mm adapter, a measuring stick, and a little neoprene pouch to store it in. The setup is beyond simple as the adapter comes attached and all you have to do is screw the lens onto your Flip 7 kit, as you would any other filter. Backscatter claims that you can shoot objects only 3 inches away and fill your entire screen, but does this lens really deliver? Well, I won't leave you waiting, absolutely. This is without a doubt my favorite purchase for the GoPro yet. I was blown away by the detail I could get with my Hero 7, and on my first dive using it, I had very little difficulty finding my focal distance. It really opens up a whole new world of videography. I actually found that while the focal distance stick was a nice touch, with a little practice it's not even necessary. The ability to flip the lens off also comes in handy. For example, last week while I was shooting this macro footage, a sea lion popped up behind us and I could easily pop the filter off and get some wide GoPro footage without a problem. I have noticed that I'll occasionally not snap the filter back into place properly, so just make sure you feel it click. Otherwise you end up with this little thing in the corner. Now, when using the Flip 7 III filter kit, you don't have the ability to use a lens and the filter simultaneously, but given the nature of macro videography and the need for good lights, you'd never want to use them at the same time anyway. On that note, you will want to have lights when you use this. I personally use dual Solo 6300 lights, but that's really another whole conversation. I'd usually give more cons, but in all honesty, it's just such a blast to shoot with this. I couldn't recommend it more, and it's a great way to get into shooting macro without having to purchase a far more expensive camera. As always, if you have any questions or other products you'd like me to review, leave a comment down below. And don't forget to subscribe for more videos.